What's up, guys? It's Angelica Lumia with Pacific Rim Video, and we are here in Covina, California for the charity event called Friends of Treasure. Um, if you guys don't know, we have a little girl from this area. Her name is Treasure, and she has tongue cancer, so basically this is just an event thrown for her. Um, lot, uh, it's a really good cause. I mean, there's a bunch of vendors. As you can see right now, we have the dance crew collaborate performing, and they're just supporting, supporting the cause. Um, so, you know, we, we have a, a couple of um, interviews with some of the dance crews and the performers. And um, right now, hi Chelsea, are you ready to do a quick interview? Okay, so I have a very special lady right next to me. Why don't you introduce yourself? Hey, I'm Chelsea. I'm Treasure's mom. That's who I am. And we're here today fundraising to, um, sorry, I got emotional, try to, um, raise money to get treasure surgeries that she needs for a very rare tumor inside of her stomach. Do you want to um, elaborate exactly of what it is that she has? Because I feel like a lot of people don't really know. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, uh, well basically there are thousands of different types of tumors. The classification of the tumor that she has is called a vascular malformation. There are three different classifications of that tumor. There's the, the venous, the lymphatic, and the arterial. She had the venous the last time we, the last time we had our, our bout with this tumor. Um, what makes Treasure's tumor so rare is that it's inside of her tongue, and this is where it's causing life-threatening issues to her. Um, it's it, it's very apparently it's very difficult to deal with the tongue. I'm not I'm not quite sure why, but um, even the head neurosurgeon at USC Medical Center didn't you know want to touch her. So. She lived three years surgery free after having nine surgeries in Colorado at a doctor that specializes in that, that's all he does, that tumor. It doesn't get any better than that. So, but the tumor is back, it has come back, um, and she does need treatment again. And I, I did have a hearing with the Department of Health and they still, they still turned me down. They would rather cut my daughter's tongue out, which is not a guarantee that that tumor won't reroute itself and grow somewhere else then just pay for her to go to Colorado. So I've got amazing people around me. I've got you guys, Marlon and Styles Dance Studio and the team at Urban Street Dam. They all, they just came together and they just said, hey, we're doing this. And I mean, it's amazing right. as you can see, it's totally amazing. And just knowing, I mean, all these people here are in support for her. For her, you know? for my daughter. Yeah. And the, the dancers and, you know, performers and all these vendors. I mean, how, do, how does that feel? Like knowing that so many people want to support this cause? Oh, it's. It's it's amazing. I almost I almost feel like I almost feel like God's trying to reach us through her because we are being brought together. The dance community, you know, regular people. You've got beauty queens over here. You've got all these you know, I, I can't think of the word for it, but all these different types of people coming together for one little girl and that I mean, it's amazing and if that's what God you know wants to use us for then hey you know we're on board and it's an amazing ride Definitely. and you know and also knowing that because her condition is so rare it, it, it helps enlighten people to know that there is things like this and it is serious and and the misdiagnosis right. she was misdiagnosed twice and had two unnecessary surgeries so it, it is it is important to get it out there you know there's a lot of things out there that people know okay you have this you have that you, you kind of know what you're dealing with and you know how to treat it so we actually I actually when I thought treasure was completely cured I filed friends of treasure nonprofit because I want to help families and kids and people you know who are diagnosed with this and it's not just you know a child I mean it, there's a lady that had one in her uterus she contacted treasure she was here in California she ended up going to Colorado for her treatment so it's I I want to I want to get get that network going and, and help other people and let them experience you know the overwhelming support that we experience amazing do you have any advice for you know especially since treasure you know beautiful girl young girl but like for people dealing with you know just cancer sick, sick, sickness in, in general do you have any advice like words of encouragement for them it's really hard it's really hard um, as you can see it's really hard I just I try to keep 
I keep in my mind that God has a plan and there's a reason for it. And maybe it has absolutely nothing to do with you. Maybe he's using you to reach somebody else. But keep, keep strong and no matter what, what they tell you, keep fighting and keep researching, keep going to other doctors. You know, just because we live in a big state, it doesn't always mean that we have the answer here for what you have. So don't be afraid to go outside of California and do what you need to do and research. Yeah, definite research, research, research. Well, I mean, look at, seeing the event today, it's obviously a lot of people are in support and it was a great turnout and it's not even over yet. It's just so beginning. Exactly. It is just beginning. beginning. Yeah. So, thank you. Is there any, um, anywhere that um, the viewers can go, like for a website or anything? They can go to friendsoftreasure.com. Um, there's also a Facebook page set up for her for um, Friends of Treasure. So they can go to those two places on friendsoftreasure.com. She does journal. She kind of lets you know how she feels. You can write notes to her on there and, and blog and, you know, just kind of write back. And she checks it every day. And it was set up for her by her school principal. And that that would be the best way. Write her a note. Send her a note. She always reads them, especially when she's down and, you know, not, not doing too good. Like, to look at her right now, she looks fine, right? But when this thing flares up, it's hanging out of her mouth. It's that big. And the thing about it, it's not on her tongue. It's in her tongue. So it's stretching and pulling all of those things. And it literally, I, I, I can't even, I can't tell you what it is that she goes through. But, yeah. Knowing that so many people are here to support. And, yes, check out friendsoftreasure.com. Please write to her. And it, it will also make you feel good. Like you, Yeah. Yeah. Right. Read the notes that are written to her. It will just inspire you, really. Well, thank, thank you so much, Chelsea. Thank you. And please. You're awesome. No, thank you. And friendsoftreasure.com and Jalkalumia Pacific Rim Video. <laughs>